neighborhood staple now destroyed and customers and employees say they are devastated. A fire Wednesday evening gutted once upon a child, a clothing store on Howe Avenue. Luckily, everyone did make it out safely. But a Sacramento firefighter did suffer some minor injuries. He's okay though. CBS 13's Angela Masalam is live at the scene with the latest. Angela? And Sonny Christina, the store is completely gone. And now let me talk to you a little bit about how intense this fire was. It was so bad, almost every single store across this strip is shut down today because of the smoke damage. Meanwhile, employees and customers of Once Upon a Child say they are absolutely devastated by the loss. I had to see it to believe it because. You know, this is like my home away from home. It was supposed to be Melissa Guerrero's first day back on the job after being away on vacation. I'm just heartbroken. Guerrero says once upon a child was a staple in the Arden area and many families depended on it to clothe their children. We see people on a weekly basis, daily basis, something they were always so thankful that we were we were there. It was everything. I came here for my son every single time. It was like the best store ever. <laughs> the Taylors are one of many families shocked who exclusively shopped at the store. It makes me tear up because it's like really it's like a second home to me. <laughs> I always came here every single weekend and now it's gone. The fire started somewhere inside the clothing store and within minutes shot up through the roof. SAC Metro firefighters say the blaze quickly ran through the building. It was a close call for one fire captain on the roof who almost fell in but was swiftly rescued by his comrades. Seconds really from, from the minute that he had gotten into what we call a near miss type of a situation. Sacramento Fire Captain Keith Wade says the injured firefighter could have fallen down a 16 foot drop. They put their training and their own um, uh, regard for their for their own safety aside as they responded to help one of their own. Scary, tense moments for customers and firefighters. A loss for the Arden neighborhood and employees like Guerrero, who's now out of a job. We depended on this store. I'm just so sad that it's it's no more. Now the injured firefighter is at home recovering. Crews say they don't know how or where this fire started. SAC Metro Fire investigators are now calling on the public for help. They're asking anyone who saw anything to please call their arson tip line. Angela Masalam at Arden Arcade for us. Angela, thank you.